Hey buddies, my name is Crap Chinstrap and welcome back to Will You Press The Button? First question, you get the best gaming PC ever made, but you can only play Minecraft. Well, I'd still have the best gaming PC ever made and you can do other stuff, so I could edit my videos on that PC that can only play Minecraft. I can use my other PC to record the games, because then I can play other games other than Minecraft. So hell yeah, I get a free gaming PC, why not? Nice. Cool. Next question. You can tell when someone is lying to you, but you can't call them out on it. I'd still want to know, I guess. You know, you know, someone's like lying to you. You, just, you. you could know in your heart that they're wrong and just never ever trust them. Um, and then you can then you can whittle out the people that you know that you can trust as well, which is which is great. So yeah, I'd want to know who I could trust. I could have some true friends. That'd be great. Yeah, I'll do that. Why not? I don't need to call them out on it, really. Pokemon becomes real, and you get to own your Pokemon of choice. But you will always lose Pokemon battles. <laughs> well, that sort of... Um, no. Oh, I don't know if I'd want that. Because the idea is to become the very best, like no one ever was. I mean, to catch them is my real test, and to train them is my cause. Um, I'll travel across the land, you know, searching far and wide. And these, these Pokemon, you, you understand, the power that's inside. Pokemon! Gotta catch them all! It's you and me! No, I can't keep it up. <laughs> no, I, I'd have to say no. I'd love Pokemon to become real, because that would be so epic. Although, you know... With the, with the standard of people in my town, I, I, I'd imagine they wouldn't be that hard to beat if it was... But I'd still lose to them, so I, I'd, I'd just look worse. I, uh, no, I'd have to say no. I don't want to. I don't, I don't want to be the worst. Okay, that was quite a good dilemma, actually. You can have any power, but there is someone else always on the news with the same power as you, but is better at it than you. <laughs> Oh, imagine the possibilities, though. I mean, there's always someone on the news or TV that's better than you at doing something that you... I mean, you know, it's like when you think, oh, yeah, I'm a, I'm a funny person, then you watch, like, Lee Evans or, you know, Ross Noble or someone else funny, that kind of thing. It's, it's the same, but, yeah, I could have any power. I don't care that someone else is better at it than me. I could, you know, I could still... In fact, no, you've got to think about it, actually. The power I'd have, for example, if I was to pick one, I'd maybe like invisibility or teleportation. Um, probably teleportation, actually. That, that's that's probably the, the best one of them all, really. Um, okay, you can have teleportations. Yeah, someone's a little bit better, but I mean, what? How bad can it be, really? <laughs> I can still teleport places. That's cool. Yeah, I'd still do that. Yeah, why not? Cool. You can travel to any universe, but you cannot go back to your own universe. Ooh, imagine the life you could have, though. Imagine if, like, there's so many universes, right? You could literally go to all of them. I mean, to be fair, going to another universe, you could spend, like, 30 years there. And you go to another universe, spend another 30 years there, and you're pretty much going to be dead at, the point, at that point anyway, so there's no point coming back. I mean, yeah, for, for a lifetime of experiencing all kinds of different things, I think it would be worth the sacrifice. Yeah, yeah, I'd do that. Yeah, why not? <laughs> okay. You get $1,000, but this website would no longer exist. Yep. <laughs> nice and easy. I like money. <laughs> uh, you'll be able to turn into a person that is 15 meters tall, but you have to take orders from someone really, really short. Well, everyone would be really, really short anyway if I was 15 meters tall. You realize how tall that is? Jesus Christ. We're like, on average, like, aren't we like 1.6 meters tall or something like that? So 50, so pretty much 10 times my height. That's insane. <laughs> you know, everyone would be really short anyway, so anyone that I speak to would have to, you know, yeah, whatever. For God's sake, that, yeah, that's a ridiculous question when you think about it. You have an unlimited supply of money, but you have to donate $10 billion a year to nuclear weapon development that could destroy the world. Yeah, but I'd be donating $10 billion to nuclear weapon development, but then I could donate 
100 billion dollars to anti-nuclear weapon development. Yeah! There you go. I see I thought that through. That's that's logic thinking for you right there. Genius. Love it. Okay, yeah. Why not? <laughs> Um, you can re-sculpt yourself, sim style, change your hair, face, body and everything. But you only have 20 more years to live as the new you. Yeah, but it doesn't say how many times I can re-sculpt myself. Because it says, right, so you've changed yourself and it says you've got 20 years to live as the new you. But then at 19 years, I could simply change myself to look younger and have another 20 years to live as the new me. Yeah, again, logic thinking would just, yeah. You'll get one million dollars, but someone on the earth will die. Yep, nice and easy question because people are dying. You've seen that advert, someone's dead, someone's dead, someone's dead. I'd just get a million dollars on one of those clicks and perfect. <laughs> yeah, and like that comment says, bye Bieber, hopefully it'll be Justin Bieber, that'll be awesome. That'll be the greatest day of all time. I, I get a million dollars and Justin Bieber dies. Oh yes. Uh, get ten million dollars every year, but you can only use dial-up internet. Well, even though it is dial-up, it would still have... It could theoretically still have the speed of broadband, because dial-up is how you actually connect to the network. Um... Yeah, is that, is that annoying? I'm right, aren't I? I, I, I swear I'm right. That, that makes sense, because dial-up is the connection to the internet through the phone line. But... The phone lines are now fiber optic, so even if I was to dial up, it would still be fiber optic connections. And I'd get $10 million every year. Well, there you go. You can back in time in a DeLorean. What? You can back in time in a DeLorean. Well, well, well phrased there. But you can't kill anyone important, i.e. Hitler, or save someone's life, or relationship, or travel to the future. Well, you shouldn't kill anyone anyway because of, you know, causality, everything like that. In theory of causality, because, you know, they say, like, if you tread on a fly, that could affect everything in the future and everything will change, not necessarily for the better. And, you know, there's, there's, there's things like, yeah, if you did kill Hitler, obviously loads of people would be safe, but then you never know what would happen, you know, in the place of Hitler in that time in history. So something else could happen, someone else could come along and be even worse. You never know. So, um, well, I'd still do that, because I wouldn't really need to kill anyone, I guess. Okay. <laughs> well, that was fine. You get your dream job, but your favourite TV show gets cancelled. Well, if I've got my dream job, I'll be making tons and tons of money, and I could fund the, the recreation of the show myself. So, yeah. Nice. Cool. Last question. You are reborn knowing everything you will ever know. What? You are reborn knowing everything you will ever know, okay. But this time you'll only live to 30. Um... Knowing everything I'll ever know, so I know the answer to every question. Like even the most important question. So I know the answer 42 then, do I? And I'll only live to 30, and then... Yeah, but then I'll go down in history as, like, the most knowledgeable person of all time. Like, Albert Einstein would be my little bitch. Because, <laughs> you know, I would, I would know the answer to everything. That, that, yeah. I'd still live, to, I'd live 30, but then I'd be an absolute legend for the rest of time, because I would have answered all the questions. Yeah, cool. Well, yeah, well, that's, that was, that was an interesting one, actually. I had to think about that one. But yeah, if you've enjoyed the episode, like, comment, subscribe, and do what you YouTubers do. I'll see you guys in the next episode. Peace out for now. Bye-bye!